good morning. Fresh this morning, Thursday. Lovely little job today. Listen, um, had an hard night last night coaching um, yesterday afternoon and late evening. So um, I chose to do this job today. Nice little job, nice little number. Get it done, let's have a look. As things happen, someone's just reversed into the wall and fractured it, so all this top is loose. So I've checked the below work, solid, hasn't been affected. Front's good. So what I'm gonna do is just take this off, clean the bricks up and relay them. So it just looks like there's been no amendment now. Okay, I'm gonna run on through. So I'm gonna take off even this bit where I ain't been affected. So it all looks as one. Um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna fill it and finish the job off. But to make it blend in with the old, I'm gonna get some water, a um, little bit of mud, and a little bit of maybe milk. Mix it in. So we get that dirty, that dirty look. Okay, now I'm gonna brush it over at the end. So it all blends in with the, um, the work below so it doesn't look stand out to the eye. So let's get cracking. Right, placing the first tile down, I've seen this so many times. When you place it down, people go, yeah, smooth, smooth. Put the first one, the smooth side down. Okay, the smooth side down. So, listen, I know it's a low wall, but if you do look up or anything happens, uh, you've got a smooth surface on the outside, where people normally lay that one and you can see the rigid. Okay, so smooth side down on your first one.
Cutting these, I see a lot of people get this grinding. I was taught this from a young age. Let the blade do the work. The amount of times I see people running the blade through, just let it go smooth. Let the blade do the work. One, your diamond blade will last longer. Two, you'll get a better cut. Good. Now, the second ladder to creasing top. Now we go face up. Now we go face up. So tread down, okay? Let's make sure we go a bit more. I always like to add a little bit extra. We push it down, you know? We don't want a too big bed. Good, so now what I'm going to do is just drive on the rat with a tile because I've measured it. I've got open air. So I'm just going to make sure that she fits. One up a bed earlier. Right, so I bonded out. Now I can set the corner up, give myself a good five mil joint in between each tile. So now we can get this line up. Good, so some of these tiles, listen, they're not cut with a laser, they're cut with a machine. So you do get a little bit of defrality there, you know. Point is, keep her in the ballpark. Keep the front side to the line, the front side being the face side, what we're gonna see. You might have a bit of discrepancy on the back, but there's not much you can do about that.
good. Right, a little tip for you guys. I know I'm banging on about profiles and stuff. Listen, I've always said I can get a freehand corner up in not much more time than probably you guys set your profile up. Now, one of my little tricks, my tips is gauge up your level. Gauge up your level, okay? Instead of putting the tape out every time, looking at gauge, all you're doing is you're laying, bum, 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 bang, checking, and then you're gone, okay? A lot of people in my previous videos said, oh, didn't even use a gauge rod. But they didn't know when I was plumbing, I was gauging at the same time. So let's have a little look at her here. Look at the marks 450, 525, 600. It's all bang on gauge. Okay, so it just gives you that little bit of speed and a bit less bending down, grabbing stuff. You lay, you plumb, you gauge, and you level. Board plumb gauge. Look at the brick on edge. Put the marks in. Okay, so to the marks, we're bang on gauge. So as I lay and I level, I'll just check. As I go along.
good. So what happened was um, we lost two bricks. So I've had to replace with new. Now what I've done is I've shunted a new one down by the ivory. Okay. So the ivy are just hide that. Then once we mud and water and milk, brush it all in, they all come up just the same as them. Good, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna dong up the brick on edge first. Okay, let it go off and brush her. Because otherwise a lot of people do the fillet and then brush off and all the excess falls on the fillet. Okay, so dong your brick on edge first. Give it a bit of breathing time. Good, so what I'm doing now is I like to do this in my brick on edge, a little bit of fussy. I like to scribe a line, a level line across to give it my fillet tape, okay? So the fillet's nice and level all the way through. See, I've just scribed my line in now. Just helps out with keeping it all nice and neat, you know? Give me a level scribe line. I want to take you around the world so I can show you that you're perfect Take you to my old hood where I hit my first lick Take you around places that I used to go and stomp the ground Hey now I want to take you to my mama house and show you what she's cooking Take you to my daddy house and show you what he's smoking Take you to my siblings too and show you all the things we do For you, yeah Now come and ride, 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 ride Baby, come and take a ride, 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 ride Tell me that you're gonna ride, 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 ride Come and ride with me Take a ride, 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 baby, come and take a ride, 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 baby, come and take a ride, 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 come and take a ride with me, ride with me, hey, I wanna take you down, 85, Draco's in the backseat, watching how we bust and have them running like a track meet, take you down 20, ride it racing in the 70 lane. I wanna take you uptown where places you ain't never been Take you downtown cause you know I like to get it in Paint the town red, me and you doing what we do It's true Now come and take a ride, 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 ride Baby ride, 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 ride Come and take a ride, 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 ride with me with me Now can you ride, 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 ride Baby, come and take So in my other videos, you know, I'm a lover of my little timbers Using a joint iron on these tiles It brings the water out and just smears it to bits Whereas a timber will absorb it and give it a little bit more to play with Okay The problem I've got today is it's quite a damp day So I'm going to be all day waiting for these to dry out So I'm going to have a go clean up and then probably pop back and it will clean up a little bit of diesel. If you ain't got one of these, trowel. It's always tall. Bring your trowel through. Bring your trowel through. Timber handle. Look how that's not smearing. Look how rubbish is coming out. If you've got one of these, even better, you can just pull through. Good, so all done. Okay. I had to brush it off a little bit, Dad. The weather's not old enough. It's winter, you know. It's so severely damp, but it is what it is. Um, where we use the existing bricks, they were holding out very damp this morning. So, in hindsight, a day's job could have turned into a two days job if I would have took the bricks off the day before and dried them out. But it is what it is. She's come up quite well, guys. Listen, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on my journey. Thank you. Bye.